Hello students, let's start with a new chapter that is real fluid flow. Today we'll learn about the topic that is definition of Renal number. Moving ahead with the Renal number, firstly we should know what is meant by a dimensionless number. So a dimensionless number are those numbers which are obtained by dividing the inertia force by vicious force or gravity force or pressure force or surface tension force or elastic force as this is the ratio of one force to the other force it will be a dimensionless number this dimensionless number is also called non-dimensionless parameters the following are the important dimensionless numbers the first is Reynolds number, second is fraud numbers, third is Euler number, fourth is Weber number, fifth is Mac number. Now let us start with Reynolds number. Reynolds number, it is defined as the ratio of inertia force of a flowing fluid and viscous flows of the fluid. Thus, the expression for Reynolds number is obtained as inertia force that is Ft is equal to mass into acceleration of the flowing fluid which is equal to rho multiplied by volume multiplied by velocity upon time now this can be arranged as rho multiplied by velocity multiplied by volume upon time now by this we can write this as rho multiplied by v multiplied by a into v so now this becomes rho multiplied by a multiplied by v square and viscous force which is given by fv it is shear stress into area now shear stress is denoted by tau into a we know by newton's law of viscosity tau is mu du upon dy multiplied by a so now we can write du upon dy as v in divided by l so this becomes mu into v upon l multiplied by a by definition of Reynolds number now re is the ratio of inertia flow to the viscous flow now this can be written as fi upon fv so fi was rho a into v square divided by this is mu into v upon l into a now this term v upon l is written because du is nothing but the term related to velocity and dy is nothing but the distance between two layers so it is denoted by length so now this becomes rho into v into l divided by mu but we also know mu upon rho is nothing but nu which is also known as kinematic viscosity so now this becomes v multiplied by l upon nu in case of pipe flow the linear dimension l is taken as diameter d hence the renal number for pipe flow is re is equal to v into d upon nu which is also equal to rho v d upon mu type of flow based on Reynolds number if the Reynolds number calculated is high that is greater than 2000 then the flow through the pipe is said to be turbulent if the Reynolds number is low that is less than 2000 the flow is said to be laminar if the Reynolds number is between 2000 to 4000 the flow is said to be a transition flow so over here in this diagram i can say if my reynolds number is less than 2000 then the flow is termed as laminar but if the reynolds number greater than 4000 the flow is termed to be turbulent flow if it is in between 2000 to 4000 the flow is said to be a transition flow numerically 
these are acceptable values although in general laminar and turbulent flow are classified according to a range laminar flow falls below the renal number of 1100 and turbulent falls in a range greater than 2200 thank you